When you see someone that's really successful, it can be very tempting to think that they are pushing and forcing and strong arming their way to success. But a lot of the times behind the scenes when you talk to these people, you find that actually what they're doing is looking for greater alignment every day. And that's their secret. So how do you really know if you're actually aligned in life? That's what we're talking about here in this video. What's up guys, Alex Hine here over at Modern Health Monk. Before we jump into this video, I put together a free download, which is a free journaling worksheet. So the first link right below this video will also sign you up for a five day free journaling email series that will help you figure out what to do with your life and what exactly to do going forward. Now the first sign that you are aligned in life is that you feel excited. That's honestly the easiest way to put it. I mean, have you ever been on a date with someone that checked all the boxes on a piece of paper, right? They're physically attractive, they're smart, they're conversational, they're interesting, whatever but you just can't put your finger on that one thing, which is that you don't really feel anything and you don't really feel that excited. For a lot of people, that feeling of excitement is what gives motivation and momentum in life. So a lot of the times we may be doing three things that we think are aligned with our goals, but they're really just aligned with our mind, right? I'm a doctor because I'm, I have all this status and I make all this money, but when you talk to the person who's an MD, they're exhausted and they're miserable and they don't wanna be in that profession. So that is misalignment, right? Alignment is about an internal feeling. It's not about some external result in the moment. Just being aligned means that you're doing work or doing an activity or on a date with someone or hanging out with friends that make you feel energized and make you feel more alive. And a lot of super successful people will say, you cannot push forever because that's an energy that is never going to last. You can push for a couple years or for 10 years, but by the end of that, you're gonna be so shot that you won't even have any juice left to live. Now the second sign of alignment to me is that you feel not just energized, but you feel excited. So a common question I ask people is, do you like this activity so much that on Saturday morning at 9 a.m. you would easily be able to do it? And then do it again on Sunday, and then do it again on Monday. If it's something that is not aligned with really what you want internally, it's gonna be difficult. It's gonna feel like going to your day job on Saturday at 9 a.m. You're gonna be pissed, you're gonna feel resistance, you're gonna feel angry, you're not gonna to wanna to do it. But reflecting back even within my own life, the projects that have often worked out the best for me were the ones that had the greatest degree of alignment, which just meant the greatest degree of excitement. So when I think about writing my books or when I started my YouTube channel or when I went back to school to do my doctorate in traditional Chinese medicine, I always felt a super unnatural high degree of energy. And just because it's there at the start doesn't mean it's gonna last for the next 20 years, but certainly riding that wave should always be there at the beginning. Otherwise, this project or this person or this thing, this trip might not be aligned with you. Now to me, the third sign of alignment is that you feel like you're on the right path even if you haven't seen any success yet. Now this is really big because theoretically you would think that if you were aligned, therefore you'd be making millions of dollars. But to me, alignment is about aligning more with like a soul path as opposed to just I'm a finance guy making 250 grand a year doing some soulless stupid shuffling of papers thing. Alignment is about that internal feeling, right? Regardless of what happens externally. So feeling a sense of peace, like you're on the right path or this person is my best friend or this is the person I wanna be with, right? You don't know where you're gonna be in five years, but right now that is the feeling, that this is, you feel that kind of connection to the work or the trip or your hobbies that you're doing or your friends or your significant other, whoever. But that feeling of peace, that right now, this is the right path. I don't know where it's gonna go. I don't know if all my wildest dreams are gonna come true, but all I know is this is the thing that's right, right now. The fourth sign that you're aligned is that you have a bigger and better future. Now. Thinking back through my own life, one of the things I've noticed is that when things feel very deeply connected and very deeply aligned, you almost can see the future in the sense that, like if you've dated someone and early on you knew you really liked them and you knew you, you, know, you saw this whole future in your head, whether it was reality or fantasy, that feeling of, I can see the future, is alignment. So. Me uploading my first YouTube video, I didn't envision writing multiple books or all these other things that came after, but I could see that, oh, this could probably lead to some other good things. And those other good things, I didn't know what they were, I didn't know how they would happen, when they would happen, what way they would happen, 
but I had a sort of gut feeling that those things could possibly happen. So you can see that there's a bigger and better future. Your world gets larger. Now, a fifth quality that is inherent in if you are feeling aligned is that you actually don't care about the outcome because you're happy now. Honestly, this is one of the best barometers and metrics for if you're doing work that is really meaningful. Because if it's meaningful and makes you happy, you're gonna do it anyway, right? It doesn't matter if it's actually going anywhere. You're gonna shoot that video and put it on YouTube. You're gonna write the book, even if it's self-published, even if it's not your best, even if you don't have an agent and a publishing team. If it's aligned, you'll do it anyway. If it's love, you'll do it anyway. If it's something you've always wanted to do, you'll do it anyway. And you don't care about the outcome necessarily because you're having fun and it's fun now, not fun someday over the rainbow. It's actually fun now. And it's something that you inherently, intrinsically enjoy doing internally. It's not something that fills you up because you're making money or getting validation. You just like doing it. And again, if it's love, you'll do it no matter what, no matter where it goes. So those five signs of alignment are qualities that I look for to show me that I'm on the right path in life. Sometimes in life, look, everything feels like it's a brick wall and you're coming up against these obstacles and nothing is flowing and nothing's happening. And that's just shit happens in life. But other times, and in my opinion, what you should look for is always increasing the degree of alignment. Because if you can increase that degree of alignment, then every year your life is gonna be more and more and more energizing, which means you're gonna have longevity, right? You're not gonna be burnt out in a couple years or a couple weeks, you'll be able to do this forever. And that is ultimately the goal. So five signs you're aligned in your life and also in your work. Before you guys go, don't forget to check out the free journaling worksheet I've put together. It'll help you figure out what some of those visions are that you want and actually how to get more aligned with them. So check it out below.